Somchenkoui. Le Président, veuillez vous asseoir. Président, please be seated. <coughs> la parole est donnée à l'accusation. You may now put questions to the witness, Mr. Deputy Co-Prosecutor. Thank you, Mr. President. Merci, Monsieur le Président. Good afternoon, uh, Mr. Witness. Bon Monsieur le I, I want to uh, start by uh, going uh, to something that Council was asking you about. Sur une question que vous council a was asking la you about near the end. Vers la which fin are these de son uh, radio broadcasts Il s'agit de ces émissions radio uh, que vous avez entendues uh, alors que vous étiez um, sur le champ de bataille de l'Est. Can you tell us what when was it in 1978 that en 1978, you were sent out uh, to the uh, Eastern Battlefront? Envoyé sur le champ de de le président, president, la défense de la Maître Coppel, um, I think it was 1977. Je pense que c'était en 77 qu'il y a été um, envoyé. Il dit que c'est entre octobre 1977 et janvier 1978 que les soldats vietnamiens sont arrivés. Je pense que c'est absolument faux. C'est vous qui avez posé la question de savoir si c'était en 1978. Bref, monsieur, le témoin, à quel moment était-ce Était-ce en 1977 ou en 1978 que vous êtes allé sur le champ de bataille de l'Est Réponse. It was perhaps in late Environ 1977 or early 1978, ou début 1978. Because it was en in effet, a cool season. Il faisait frais. And when, when was it that you heard uh, these radio broadcasts in which there were ces émissions radio uh, comportant des appels lancés contre le régime de Pol Pot. Était-ce peu de temps après votre arrivée ou était-ce plutôt vers la fin de votre séjour dans la zone Est Réponse. C'était longtemps some few après, months at Pantlong. après que j'y suis Perhaps resté quelques I was mois there à for Peut-être quatre ou cinq mois. C'est seulement après que je l'ai entendu. Am I correct then that it was sometime in the mid part of 1978? Vers la mi-78. Can you tell us approximately how long before the Vietnamese troops entered Cambodia? Environ combien de temps était-ce avant l'entrée des Vietnamiens au Cambodge fin 78 ou début 78 Combien de temps avant cela avez-vous entendu ces émissions appelant les Cambodgiens à renverser le régime Réponse. It was perhaps half a month before that I heard the broadcast. Deux semaines avant. J'ai entendu donc ces émissions. It was perhaps in mid-August. Ça a dû être vers la mi-août, peut-être. Or early September, when I heard September. about the broadcast. C'est à ce moment-là que j'ai entendu. And there was a fraction uh, within the, the unit, and at the time I uh, was fleeing. Uh, through the forest. Une division au sein de l'unité et j'ai pris la fuite par la forêt. L'accusation, je comprends. Um, let me turn now to j'y reviendrai demain. D'autres questions sur uh, votre leave, passé. Uh, like J'aimerais uh, présenter au témoin uh, a document that's included un in document his DC cam interview. qui fait partie de son entretien au CDCAM. C'est E3-7523. Mais Khmer uniquement. C'est une biographie en Khmer d'une page. Puis-je remettre ce document au témoin
Monsieur le témoin, veuillez examiner ce document et me dire si c'est une biographie que vous avez établie sous le Kampuchea démocratique. Yes. It is my biography, but I biography. do not uh, really. I could not uh, read it uh, well because Mais je ne peux pas bien la lire. I could uh, read only some information on it, je and I, 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 am, I see my names uh, from vois ici mon nom. It is uh, for sure my biography. Hong uh, Hong, c'est certainement ma biographie. Thank you, and uh, I recognize some of the. Some of the, uh, the this is not a, a very good copy, so some of it is Certes. unclear. I've highlighted just the few parts Cette copie pas that I want to ask you about. Par passage, um, mis en and starting with the date uh, at the bottom, date is, is, is it correct that this est -ce uh, was a biography you prepared on the 11th of May 1976? La réponse, c'est exact. C'est is my biography. C'est ma biographie. I was given a copy of it. On m'en a donné un exemplaire. And I could not read it well because uh, some parts of, uh, uh, could not be read. Il y a des passages If qui ne sont look guère lisibles. Uh, at the, um, Entry that I highlighted. Question. Um, J'ai mis en évidence paragraphs une entrée, 9 and 10. paragraph 9 et 10. Paragraph 9, paragraph 9 is, indicates the date of joining the revolution, la date d'entrée dans la révolution, which is indicated as 1973, as you've testified. And then the next uh, line, uh, paragraph 10, Ligne uh, is the date of joining the youth league, uh, which you have de la entered as dans um, votre cas, c'est le 7 novembre 1974. Uh, Est-ce qu'effectivement, vous avez intégré cette Ligue de la Jeunesse du Parti en novembre 1974 La réponse, c'est peut-être exact. I became a part of the Youth League Je at Prey Dotung, Kampong Cham province. It was uh, right in the forest. Cham, en pleine forêt. I could not recall the exact month when Je I became the, the member of the Youth League. Uh, at the time, I was introduced into that league, and I did not have any documents to read. Et on ne m'a donné aucun document à lire. The last, uh, Question. La dernière ligne qui m'intéresse, c'est la treizième, which, uh, à savoir uh, fonction actuelle. Uh, um, Avez-vous uh, bien écrit ici un groupe d'adjoints Uh, at the à la rubrique time of, uh, fonction actuelle. May 1976. Donc en mai 1976, qu'avez-vous écrit okay. Réponse. I was not the with I was not the chief of the group. I was part of the group. messengers at Je the time. Je faisais partie du groupe des messagers à l'époque. I was not even the deputy Je chief of the group. Pas même chef adjoint de group. No. Okay, can, can you read for me what you wrote uh, as your current position on line 13? Ce que vous avez écrit à la ligne 13 concernant vos fonctions. It is illegible. I cannot Réponse, read it properly. Je pas it, à bien it was uh, made on 11 
of Cela May, a été fait le 11 mai 1972 ou quelque chose. Ce n'est pas clair. Was the name. And that is my Sam name. It. Okay. C'est mon nom um, qui Mr. figure. Um, L'accusation est très bien, that, le témoin. Uh, in division 310 that you were a part of regiment 313 do you remember uh, which battalion uh, you were part of vous souvenez-vous à quel bataillon vous apparteniez i was in battalion 13 réponse le bataillon 13 It was initially a regiment, but later on, when we were uh, reassigned, it was part of the uh, 13th Battalion. On a été réaffecté, et cela a été mis when you refer to when you were later bataillon. reassigned, what, what period are you referring Question. to? À quelle période faites-vous référence lorsque vous dites que vous avez été réaffecté uh. par la suite? It uh, happened probably in early 1977. After we uh, were reassigned and uh, some members Après, disappeared, que nous avons été but I myself was uh, reassigned to uh, the area of Coxrow, that is in the 13th Battalion. And then the, it was at uh, An Long Gang An and Bang La Praja. As for other soldiers, I did not know where they were or where they had been uh, reassigned to. Je ne sais pas où ils se trouvaient, à quel endroit ils avaient été Initially, uh, there were 500 soldiers départ, and it reduced to 300 and later on it further reduced and I did not know where they were uh, reassigned to. Puis par la suite, ce nombre s'est davantage uh, réduit. Je ne sais the pas, ils ont été réaffectés. Question, avant cette still regiment 13. Uh, do you remember whether you were part of a one of the battalions Alors, of Regiment 13? Regiment 13. Um, can you tell us either the battalion si number or uh, who the battalion 13, commander 13. was uh, in Regiment 13? Qui était le commandant de bataillon au Regiment 13? <coughs> At the beginning, there were three battalions which formed one regiment. And there were battalions 13, 15, and another battalion which a number I cannot recall. Dont je ne me souviens pas du code. And the 15th battalion was stationed at the Chang Kimre, while the 13th battalion was stationed in Coxrow, and another battalion was stationed in Chirolok area, that is near Barai, and so the, the main task for that battalion was to uh, do rice farming, and I was attached to the 13th battalion, which was stationed at the Coxrow area. And I was there for about a year, working in the rice field and uh, digging canals and uh, pulling rice seedlings. So I was there for Et quite a long time in the area. First je at Kapsrai, de de then I was moved to Long Kang An and to Bang Trayap. Okay, I'm just so we're clear. I'm speaking of the period in 1975 and 1976 uh, before you were reassigned to Kapsrao and Boing Prayap. Um, were you part of the 13th Battalion uh, at that time? And if so, who, who was your battalion commander? Uh, 
Je faisais partie d'une unité de messagers. Et il y avait Pour le reste, des membres, ils ont été affectés à la réception. Vous n'étiez pas attaché à un bataillon spécifique, mais plutôt à l'unité des messagers de votre régiment. Est-ce exact Plus unit. Je faisais partie à And la fois it was also de l'unité de l'économie et unit. de l'économie sous lequel il y avait And I want to ask you um, about some events that you talk about in your uh, OCIJ interview uh, uh, that happened after, abordé, uh, after you entered Phnom Penh uh, on the 17th of April 1975. Lorsque vous êtes um, à Phnom Penh. Can you tell us what happened uh, to Lonol soldiers who were found uh, hiding in Phnom Penh qui se uh, after the Khmer Rouge Penh, military entered the city après, on 17 April 1975. On 17 April 1975, I entered Phnom Penh. Je suis entré dans Phnom Penh. Uh, J'avais pour tâche d'assurer la garde à Wat Phnom. But then I was uh, sent to Chre. Puis j'ai été envoyé à Chre. On the afternoon of that day, I was sent to a stand again. L'après-midi de ce jour-là, uh, near Wat Phnom area. On m'a demandé de monter la garde près de la de Wat Phnom. That is near the office of the Près du bureau de la propagande. While I was uh, standing guard there, there was no longer any fighting, and it, it service, became uh, quiet. Il n'y avait plus de combat. There were still soldiers who were hiding calme. at the uh, concrete houses. Il y avait encore des soldats qui se cachaient dans des maisons en dur. Qui les et qui lançaient des grenades ou tiraient sur les soldats Khmers Rouges. Il y a eu des victimes. Puis on nous a demandé de couper l'eau dans la ville de Phnom Penh. Alors nous avons coupé l'eau et l'électricité. En conséquence, Uh, some soldiers came out en from hiding, certains soldats sont sortis de leur cachette, j'en ai vu quelques-uns. Le camarade Rom uh, called them out and then took them to the riverside. Les a appelés, and les a demandé de sortir, et Rom les a amenés au fleuve. Le camarade Rom a ensuite exécuté les trois soldats. J'ai été témoin oculaire de ces faits. Okay, let me read to you um, uh, an excerpt from your OCIJ statement on this subject uh, to get some clarification. Um, this is OCIJ statement uh, E3 uh, 5149 uh, your uh, statement Khmer ERN 001706 Six three three through three four uh, English zero zero two zero five zero four four uh, French zero zero five two four three nine eight quatre trois neuf huit and uh, let me read to you what you said in regards to the uh, execution that Concernant you witnessed. Quote, témoin, je cite, I saw them kill those surrendering soldiers tuer, at the Troy, Tr Troy Changbar Bridge. Au pont de Troy Changbar. Of those soldiers, Parmi ces there soldats, were four to ten, some of whom had lost their arms, some of whom had lost their legs, perdu leurs bras, and they pushed them over jambes, down into the river. Et ils les ont poussés Another thing fleuve, I saw it with my own eyes, Rum, a company yeux, chairman in the Rum, Division 310, shot three long-haired long old soldiers at the dock in front of the royal palace. De at end end of quote. Um, um, so the first citation. thing I want to clarify um, was chose. this the same same event that you describe here? 
uh, where there were some soldiers pushed off the Troy Chungvar Bridge, and some who were shot on the dock near the Royal Palace. Uh, or was this two separate events that you were aware of? Et d'autres soldats qui ont abattu des soldats de l'Ontario au chevelon. I witness the event personally. Ma réponse, j'ai été personnellement témoin de ces incidents. Were wounded and they were gathered from the Russie Hospital of Bad Russie. Et ont été and they lost uh, some of the soldiers, uh, lost their arms or legs, and later on they were pushed off uh, the uh, Troy Jongva uh, bridge. And I saw that uh, by myself. Du haut du pont de Je vu and I also witnessed uh, Comrade Drum, who executed uh, three uh, soldiers, and Rung that happened to soldats. the south side of. Uh, Wapnum. As for those soldiers who were pushed off uh, the Quant bridge, uh, they were soldiers who were uh, collected pont, from the uh, Russie Hospital. Qui ont été rassemblés de l'hôpital de Russie. And do you remember wh when did these two uh, killings take place? Um, Quand uh, est can you give us a estimate of how long after 17 April? 1975, it was when these killings occurred. Why did the Khmer Rouge come here? It happened immediately after we attacked the Phnom Penh, and so they cleansed the city. And it happened maybe a day or two after the liberation. As for the three uh, long-haired uh, soldiers, trois soldats aux chevelons, it happened uh, about uh, ten days uh, after, that is after the water and electricity was uh, cut jours, off. Then they came out from hiding from the uh, concrete house. Et électricité. Ils sont donc sortis de leur cachette dans les maisons en dur. And the the people that you saw killed. Both the wounded soldiers who were um, uh, pushed off the bridge uh, and the three uh, long hair soldiers uh, who were shot. Um, how did you know that these people were uh, former Law Nol soldiers? President. The President. Council for Kills and Pond, you have the floor, says the President. Maître Copé, vous avez la parole. Rather, Council for Nunchi. Oh, thank you for that compliment. <laughs> um, yes, Mr. President, I object to this question. Monsieur le Président de la Défense, um, uh, je m'oppose à cette question. Uh, the questions are scope, uh, Car elles sortent du champ. Two. Um, I would like to remind the chamber that um, I pursued a similar line of question in relation to a division 164 um, member about what the policy was in relation to um, um, or, or what happened right after the liberation of Pompey in uh, April 75. And I was forbidden to ask any further questions because um, um, whatever happened in the immediate aftermath um, of the liberation uh, is supposedly not part of au lendemain du jour de libération uh, the trial in 002 pas, ne faisait pas partie du champ de l'espèce. I, I don't know what counsel is referring to with this other witness, but the policy targeting uh, uh, law and all soldiers is part of, of this case. Uh, certainly the general questions about the evacuation are, are not, but the targeting of law and all soldiers remains a key part of this case, and that's the relevance of the question. Oh, that's what I thought um, uh, when I asked those questions, uh, if you allow me to this is not about the policy, this is um, about the question whether in the immediate aftermath uh, potentially war crimes were committed. 
I don't see that uh, in any way to be part of uh, Je LLH policy. Ne pense pas que uh, le crime de guerre commis au lendemain du 17 avril 115 soit parti de chance de ce procès. Lorsque j'ai posé des questions uh, à ce membre de la division 164 pour lui demander quel traitement avait été réservé aux soldats de l'ONOL qui s'étaient rendus, on m'a interdit de poser cette question. If he was, he, he shouldn't have been. <laughs> It's, it, it's a direct part of this case. L'accusation, uh, ceci fait partie intégrante et directe du champ de procès. The objection is overruled since the chamber wishes to hear the response from the witness. La chambre aimerait entendre la réponse du témoin. You, you might not remember, my, uh, Mr. Witness, my question Monsieur is. Témoin. Uh, how did you know that the Ma people that you saw killed uh, were law no soldiers? Vu être exécuté étaient des soldats de l'ONOL. I have people referring to them as l'ONOL soldiers, so I uh, Yes, uh, de I repeated uh, what I heard, and uh, simplement répété from their appearance, since they were wearing uh, military uniforms, so uh, they were probably Lunal soldiers. D'après leur uh, apparence physique, étant donné qu'ils portaient des uniformes were, militaires, were both, c'était probablement uh, des soldats both de the soldiers you saw uh, who were pushed off the uh, Troy Changvar bridge, uh, and the soldiers who were shot uh, by Rome, uh, were they both um, still in their Rome. uniforms? Portaient-ils encore leurs uniformes? No, they were wearing uh, ordinary uh, clothes. Non, ils étaient en vêtements civils et non en tenue militaire. And you've indicated that the three uh, people who were shot uh, by the royal palace were shot by rum. Um, who, who, who was Rum? What was his position? Long était par Rome. Qui est Rome? Quelle était ses fonctions? Rome was a deputy Réponse. chief of a, a company. Rome était le chef adjoint d'une compagnie. Do you know uh, who? Um, who Rum received his orders from Question. relating to the executions de of these soldiers. Rum recevait-il ses ordres concernant l'arrestation de ces personnes? Rum received order from Tahom. Uh, Réponse. Il recevait ses ordres de Tahom. And just so we're clear, by Tahom, are you referring to the Regiment commander for, her, for whom you worked as a messenger. Du commandant de régiment pour qui vous avez travaillé comme messager, Tahom. Yes, there is uh, the person. Réponse oui. Hum Hon. C'est Hum Hon. You referred to these three soldiers who were shot as uh, long-haired soldiers. Can, can you explain what, what, what did you mean by that? Why did you describe? Pourquoi les avez-vous décrits ainsi? Uh, came out from hiding and Rome called them Je les ai vus sortir de leur cachette et Rome les a appelés pour les interroger. Then uh, Rome told them uh, to go to uh, cross the river Puis on Rome a ferry to the other side. A de and then I had a gunfight. Ferry and then he, he returned. And I asked, uh, well, the three soldiers sent? Puis il est and uh, Rome said uh, they were sent by uh, the river. Et il a dit, Although I myself did not witness uh, the killing, but uh, from Rome's response, I knew that Rome had just shot the three soldiers. Mais d'après la réponse que Rome m'a donnée, j'ai su qu'il venait d'exécuter les trois soldats. And with respect to the uh, wounded soldiers, uh, who you described as uh, indicated were pushed off the Troy Changvar bridge, um, who, who was it that killed? Are those soldiers? Qui a tué ces blessés, ces soldats? I 
did not uh, know them. Réponse. Je they ne were not pas. part of the uh, artillery unit, but Ils probably ne were part of the de infantry. De l'artillerie, mais probablement de l'infanterie. Yeah, thank you for that uh, Accusation. clarification. Merci pour um, cette précision. Let me move to some questions uh, about your work. Je vais passer à des questions oui. sur votre travail. Councillor for Nunchi, you had Président. the floor. Conseil de Nunchi, vous avez la yes, parole. Yes, just to remind the chamber of its own uh, La défense, j'aimerais rappeler um, à la chambre sa propre décision. Um, I asked questions that I was objected to, but what I found question. here was uh, questions from objection. the lead co-lawyer on the 3rd of February 2016 about events 2016, taking place on uh, 17th of April, 18th of April. And the president avril, says the following, suit, lead co-lawyer, in fact, your question may be related to the scope Monsieur of 002 slash 01, which was already concluded. Here we are having a different scope for the proceedings in case 002 slash 02, and it may be a waste of time. Nous avons, euh, Only a limited number of questions were allowed in relation to the scope, and as you observed, there were several objections from other parties on the other side of the bench in relation to the questions which are outside the scope of the case. Et, uh, il y a eu um, de it is indeed de uh, sur a hearing that this particular prosecutor was not present. It was his colleague, um, Vincent de Wilde. Malheureusement, a, as I said, le procureur n'était pas là. C'est son collègue, Vincent de Wilde, qui était là. At least sur cette we should be coherent question in, um, and sur consistent la rather, division 164, la Chambre devait donc, devrait donc faire preuve de cohérence dans ses décisions. Uh, Mr. Witness, uh, I want to turn to some questions about uh, the period that you worked as a Hans, a messenger. Au sujet um, de la période, how, how soon à was it after 17 April 1975 um, that you were signed to be uh, the messenger for Han? été affecté comme messager de Han? I worked as a messenger. Uh, j'ai travaillé comme messager il y a très longtemps. Uh, about a month or two after I uh, became a soldier, un mois ou deux après to, uh, que je suis devenu soldat. A battle front at national road number six, and by that time he uh, called me and assigned me to be his uh, messenger. Il m'a appelé et m'a demandé so just so de I'm devenir clear, son you, messager. You were already working as Hans' messenger clair, before 17 April 1975. Avant le 17 avril 1975, comme messager de Han, vous avez bien compris? Yes, uh, it was uh, since uh, that time. Réponse oui. That is depuis before 1975. Since we were still fighting against the Lunar soldiers. Étant donné que and on after, uh, after April 1975, when Division 310 was established um, and uh, you were present in Phnom Penh, um, where was Han's office uh, located? Where was he based? Han's office was uh, located at Wat Phnom, le bureau de Han that is opposite Phnom, the uh, office of the propaganda, and after propaganda. he got married, he uh, moved to live uh, near Chiru Yangwa, and he remained living Chang there for uh, quite a, a, a long period of time, Il that is for uh, two to three months. Then I was reassigned away from him. Puis that is, uh, I was reassigned to uh, live at uh, Cop Throw while he was Cop still Throw. living at Choi Yongwa. I was the only member of that unit who was reassigned to uh, Cop Throw. And I was there uh, with uh, other uh, members of the battalion 13. Uh, Mr. President, with your leave, I'd like to provide uh, the witness with a, a document. Uh, this is E3 of 1585. 
E3 slash 1585. It's a, uh, a list of uh, participants uh, at a uh, October 1976 general staff study session. session. I've included the two pages that have the representatives of Division 310. Uh, which you'll find at Premier ERN 00095533-34, starting for English at 00897-650, a French 00611-637. May I provide this to the witness? Puis-je remettre ce document au témoin? Yes, you may. And court officer, please le send over the uh, document autorisé. to the witness. Le président, vous êtes autorisé. remettre le document au témoin. Um, uh, Mr. Witness, this is a list of um, Monsieur le témoin. Uh, uh, the high rank, uh, relatively high ranking cadres of de Division 310 who attended a general staff. De la division study 360, session in October 1976. I've highlighted the third name on that list, uh, which is Comrade Han, uh, identified Han, as a member of the Division 310 office, and he is the third the person 310. listed C'est la troisième personne, after division secretary immédiatement Hun après and deputy le secrétaire Hun. de la division Hun et le secrétaire um, Hun. Is this the, the Han for whom, for whom you worked uh, bien le as Han a messenger, lequel, uh, was he someone who was a member of the division, uh, division office? Du bureau de la division. Yes, I was uh, Han's messenger. Réponse oui, j'étais le messager de Han. And if you could look at, uh, turn the, to the second page, uh, number, page. Uh, number 26 Au on the same list sur la même liste. is uh, a comrade Song, Vous avez le Song, comrade Song uh, who is identified as the commander of Regiment 13. Du Regiment 13. Um, do you remember uh, Do you remember this person named Vous Song? De cette uh, was personne, there a period where uh, Han was promoted to the... Y a-t-il eu un moment où Han a été promu? Sup. Yeah. Are you talking about the sup? Réponse. I am not familiar with the name of a son. Voulez-vous parler de sut? Je ne suis pas le nom de son nom. Ma question, do you remember whether Ma question est la suivante. Han, at some point, was vous promoted vous from Regiment 13 Commander to become a member of the division office? de la division 13 pour devenir un membre du bureau de la division. Tahon uh, was the chairman of uh, Regiment 13 and he was also a deputy commander of that uh, division. However, uh, during the latter part, I was not that close to him. At the beginning, I was uh, close to him, but uh, later on, after he got married, I was not that close to him anymore. And when you talk about Comrade Han in your OCIJ statement, um, this is at E3 uh, 5149, Khmer 00170. 634 uh, English 00205044 a French 00524398 you say uh, that in regards to Han quote he was accused of being a traitor um, how, uh, how and when did you learn that Han had Comment been accused of being a traitor? Et quand avez-vous accusé, avez-vous appris que Han avait été accusé de traîtrise ou de trahison? At that time, Why? the situation Réponse. was rather chaotic. La situation there were chaotic. fightings here and there. Il y avait des combats ici et là. And he 
was aware of the situation. Lui était au so he de la went uh, to visit uh, the rice field Il and he rode his uh, motorbike. En visite à la rizière, and, uh, à motocyclette. Probably there was an accident. Je suppose and uh, the situation started to develop from there. Every Et day, one or two là, people les choses ont were arrested. Chaque and jour, probably he was realized of uh, what's going to come. Il a dû and for that reason, he committed suicide by riding his uh, motorbike a through a packed vehicle. So he, uh, un he uh, rode his bicycle into that packed vehicle and broke his neck and died. Il s'est brisé le cou et il est mort. Who, who was it that told you Question. that Han had committed suicide by riding his uh, motorcycle into a parked vehicle? En entrant en collision avec un véhicule parqué alors qu'il roulait à motocyclette. No one told me Réponse. about that. Personne ne me l'a dit. I was suspicious. I, I was in doubt at the time. He was accused of uh, something, and uh, the situation was chaotic. Some uh, il a été accusé de quelque chose, la situation était chaotique. people shot uh, themselves dead. Des gens se sont suicidés par balle. And uh, I suspected that he je me suis dit uh, had a problem and killed himself. Il a dû avoir des problèmes et qu'il a dû se suicider. President, you may now proceed. Counsel for Mr. Kiu Zampon, Kung Zampon. Thank you, Mr. President. I would like to make an observation in relation to the names in the Khmer document. In relation to the document E3-1585, number number three, there is the name Han, not Hon. And uh, Mr. Co-Prosecutor, could you please clarify the name once again or correct the pronunciation of the name? Uh, I, will, I will try to correct my pronunciation. I think um, Nguyen Che, as counsel, already asked him about this during, during his questioning. Um, the reason I asked you about this story of him dying c'est peut-être une question de prononciation. Si je vous interroge sur ce supposé décès à motocyclette, c'est parce que Han, membre de la division, apparaît dans une liste de S21. Liste que j'aimerais faire remettre aux témoins. Il y a deux documents. D'abord, E3-9843. 9, 8, 4, 3, et ensuite E3, 22, 85. Je demande à faire remettre ces documents aux témoins. Le président, allez-y. President, yes, please. The court officer, please bring the documents. Monsieur l'audience, veuillez remettre ces documents aux témoins. And uh, while it's being provided to the witness, let me just uh, identify these more specifically for the record. Je vais um, préciser les références. Uh, first of all, um, the full name of this individual, Le nom complet uh, Rose, de cette personne, Pat, Rose alias Pat, Pat Han, alias Han, member of the Division 310 de la, office, du bureau de la division 310, uh, is number 7835 on the OCIJ S21 list. Liste de S21 établi uh, par le BCJ, date d'entrée 25 janvier 1977. Uh, uh, dans le premier witness, document, um, E3 E3 bar slash 9843 uh, at Khmer 01010004 is part of a list of January 1977, uh, on the 25th of that month, uh, Han appears as number 19 on that list. Uh, the second document provided to the witness is E3-2285, Khmer 00009199. Through 200, 
English 00873411 and there's no French translation. Uh, this is a list of S21 prisoners smashed on 7 May 1977 and Rus Pat Elias Han is number 64 on that list. Um, Mr. Witness, uh, my first question, question uh, I've témoin. highlighted the names in these lists. En um, dans ces listes. Uh, the person who's recorded on these S21 lists, uh, division member Il ici uh, Han, de Han is, is this the same division. person that you worked for Son as a messenger? Dans cette liste, dans ces listes, est-ce que c'est la même personne que celle dont vous avez été messager? Réponse. No. Non. I do not know an individual by the name Han. I know a person Han. by the name Hon. Je un Hon. There were two Hon. One uh, Hon. was at the infantry and another one was uh, within the artillery unit. And as for Han, I do not know this guy. Quant à Han, je ne le connais pas. Well, let me come back then and ask you again. Question. You've indicated that the person you worked for, you say his name is Han, was a very high-ranking member of Division 310. The person you worked for, was he a very high-ranking member of Division 310? Uh, no, he was not. Um, and Division he was part of the uh, regiment, and before that, regiment, he uh, was part of the battalion. Then he was promoted to be part of the ensuite, regiment, regiment, and he was arrested later on. You, you've referred to Question. his full name. Vous avez cité the son full name complet. of the Han Le you're talking Han about, was it him, parlé, Han? Was donc him Han? Full name, the full name is Hum Hon. Hum Hon. And he had no alias name. Il n'avait pas de surnom. Are, are you sure are Question. you sure that this person died during the Khmer Rouge regime? Que cette personne est morte sous les Khmer Rouge? I am sure. J'en suis sûr. He died at uh, Gil, uh, Gilol Il est mort Le Pramoué, and he six. was buried at Rusaykeo, close to Onmoy. I was back then at Kapsra, and I was not à allowed to uh, accompany those who Je pas été buried him. I uh, heard from his messengers. Ce sont ces messagers qui m'en ont informé. So let Question. me make sure I understand. Pour être the sûr bien compris, reason you believe that this Han si died was because Han you were told this by his messengers. Est mort, est parce is that que correct? Ces messagers vous l'ont dit, n'est-ce pas? Nyam. Réponse. His his messenger's name was Nyam. Le nom de son messager était Nyam. He told me that. C'est lui qui me l'a dit. Why I uh, did not go to uh, talk to my uh, supervisor, je pas and he told me that uh, my supervisor died because uh, he uh, crashed, hit the uh, car, and died because uh, he broke his neck. And later on, he was buried at a recycling, and, and I do not know where exactly. Et je ne sais pas où exactement où il a été enterré. And uh, when when was it that uh, Han died? Question. À quel endroit? Uh, can you give us Han tell us when Han died in relation mort? to the time uh, that Hun was arrested? Au moment de l'arrestation de Hun. Hon died after Réponse. one month after Hon Hun died. Un mois après Hun. All right, uh, thank you for that. 
I want to uh, ask you some questions now about the meeting uh, that you uh, already referenced sur une raison, une réunion dont vous avez déjà parlé, une réunion où les aveux de Eun ont été diffusés. Qui a présidé la réunion There was a vehicle coming to the uh, meeting venue and he got out of the vehicle and came into the hall and spoke. It happened uh, at the hospital place behind uh, Wat Phnom. I was told that uh, the speaker's name was Kyo. He had a dark complexion. She had a dark complexion, and uh, I heard uh, people mention uh, his, her name, rather. Uh, the name was Kyo, Kyo Ponaret, but I do not know this person. Mais je ne connais pas cette personne. The person who presided over the meeting, was it a female or a male? une femme ou un homme qui a présidé la réunion? Réponse, un homme. Uh, male. And it was a male named uh, Takyu, Q, is that right? Réponse, et il s'appelait Takyu, n'est-ce pas? I heard the people mention the oui, name Q. Oui, j'ai entendu les gens citer le nom de Q. How, how many other Division 310 soldiers were at this meeting? Combien d'autres soldats de la Division 310 étaient présents à cette réunion? There were around 1,000 participants. Il y avait environ 1,000 participants. And um, did I understand correctly that uh, this? A meeting of 1,000 people was held uh, Donc, cette uh, behind, somewhere behind Wat Phnom. Can you Phenom? describe for us the, uh, the room or the building uh, where the meeting le took place? Ou la salle de réunion? There was no building. It uh, was simply a kitchen hall, big hall, simple, un a big structure uh, with a corrugated iron roof. Avec un toit en it was a big uh, structure. C'était une grande structure. How, how, how long uh, was this meeting? Uh, Question. Was it hours? Was Combien it a whole day? Was Quelques it a heures, meeting that entière? took place over several days? Uh, how long was the meeting? It was. It did not last Réponse. long. Elle it pas duré happened only a, one morning. Then the meeting was concluding. Nothing, nothing was discussed much. Uh, the uh, topic of arrest uh, was chose. mentioned, Il and then we were released to work in Ensuite, the field. On nous a and can you describe Question. for the court what you remember uh, in regards to the playing uh, of this audio recording uh, at this de la meeting? De cet enregistrement sonore. De quoi vous souvenez-vous? President, uh, please hold on, uh, Mr. Winnes, uh, counsel for Mr. Kizapon, you may now proceed. Um, je, I can anticipate uh, the answer because it appears to me that uh, in the statements, uh, the witness said uh, that confessions were played. Personnes. Confessions ah, of si, people. Uh, so, de de if the témoin, point is asking the witness uh, about the content of these confessions, then we have to object. Um, 
the purpose of this question is not to question. elicit information Cette about question the content of the confession. If we wanted to do that, we can read the confession. The purpose is to know uh, what was played to, uh, to these Division 310 soldiers uh, and how that affected their, uh, their knowledge, particularly uh, in relation to matters, whether this was a source uh, of information for these people as to this reported plot. Quant à ce supposé plan. Donc, la use of this Donc, recording at a meeting uh, is a is a legitimate evidence. Obviously, the content uh, of the uh, confession est une, un fait for its truth légitime. remains completely Bien inadmissible. Bien sûr, il est interdit d'examiner le contenu de la pièce en question. Dans la manière dont la question well, est posée, the way the question is phrased, which is what do you joué, remember given what was played, I do not see la question du contenu how we can avoid the content of what was being played uh, on those soit tapes, la that is to say confessions. Un vrai problème, il faut Either poser the question la question is problematic and should be phrased otherwise, or the co-prosecutor's explanation is not clear to me. Let me give you an example. We have uh, used, uh, you've allowed uh, S21 confessions uh, to be used, uh, evidence to be heard about confessions being sent to other regions uh, where they were then used as a basis to arrest people. The reason uh, the confessions are admissible in that reason is we're not using them for the truth. recevables en l'espèce. We're using them to see what use was made of the confessions la véracité de leur teneur. On les emploie pour voir comment leur régime a employé ses aveux. C'est un fait important à comprendre. Cela ne porte pas sur la teneur de ces aveux, mais bien sur les raisons pour lesquelles les gens ont été torturés, interrogés. Il s'agit aussi de savoir à quoi servait cette information au régime. Un autre aspect essentiel de l'utilisation de ces aveux, c'était la propagande, à savoir de la propagande à diffuser pour faire accepter cette idée que des vastes purges s'imposaient à cause de l'existence de ces complots. Donc, je le répète, ceci n'est aucunement examiné sur le plan de la véracité du contenu. Il s'agit de comprendre l'utilisation qui était faite de ces aveux, en particulier à cette réunion. Le Président, President, Mr. Deputy Co-Prosecutor, please uh, reformulate your question. Reformuler votre question. All right, um, Mr. Mr. Witness, I don't want you to talk Très about the Je ne vous content pas of what you heard on the recording for now, que vous avez but can you give us a general description uh, of pour what happened uh, when uh, Q Lorsque Q a, di uh, a diffusé l'enregistrement de ses aveux. Réponse. I heard the sound of shackle J'ai entendu uh, des bruits de chaîne. Confessions. Itself. Et I heard, uh, des aveux proprement dit. I heard the broadcast that the parents, your parents, dire, uh, all died. Please do not think of them. Go back to the field and work. Ne pensez plus à eux. Retournez dans les champs et travaillez. And uh, the north zoners uh, did not have any uh, freedom, but only the southwest. A zone uh, cadres had rights and a freedom. We were under their command. We had no uh, uh, chief of unit. Nous n'avions pas de chef d'unité. 
Let me read to you uh, an excerpt from your OCIJ statement on this. Uh, this is E3 5149 Khmer 001706364 English 00205044 French 00524398 Uh, this is what you told OCIJ. Voici ce que vous avez dit au uh, during a meeting of about 1,000 soldiers in Phnom Penh, Takyu announced your mothers and fathers have all been killed. Then they played a tape recording of Ta Un. Un enregistrement I heard de the Ta sounds Un. of a chain and chaîne. heard the voice of Ta Un talking, describing his personal history son when histoire he personnelle the party. et sa trahison And du parti. Quote. Fin de citation. Um, first point to clarify. Premier point à tirer um, au clair. You've mentioned it twice today. The statement, Deux fois aujourd'hui, your mothers and fathers have all been killed. Uh, was that something that Q said? Entendu or was that something that you heard on the confession recording? Est-ce que vous avez entendu Q dire cela? Ou est-ce que vous avez entendu cela dans la bande sonore des aveux First, Réponse. the confession, confession was not broadcasted. Dans un premier temps, les aveux n'ont pas été diffusés. The man was speaking through the microphone and said, a pris la parole au micro et a dit, your, all your parents vos parents have been killed. ont tous été tués. I was paying attention to the time, and then the, the recording was played, and I heard the uh, sound of chaîne. As for the message that uh, message, all your parents have been killed, vos ont I have tué, heard directly from the, uh, him. De la bouche de lui que je ai and uh, the sound of chants of chains was heard chaîne, from uh, the uh, recording. Je les ai entendus Later dans on, the, uh, the, the people were Par removed. la suite, uh, des gens ont été retirés. When Question. Played, Quand um, Kieu a diffusé Un's cet enregistrement des aveux de Eun, uh, a-t-il dit in order to make him give si Eun avait été torturé pour le forcer à livrer ses aveux. It was not Réponse. mentioned at all about uh, the mistreatment. I heard uh, the sound of chains. J'ai entendu des bruits de chaînes. Uh, and as for beating, I uh, did not hear any discussion of such uh, beating. Je n'ai pas quoi que ce soit concernant des coups. Do you know why Q played this Recording for Question. you and the other division cadres. vous pourquoi que a diffusé cet enregistrement à votre intention et à celle des autres cadres de la division? They wanted us to hear. Il voulait to know and nous and que nous want all of us not to nous avertir tous do what uh, he de did. ne pas suivre son exemple. We were told that uh, we have we had no longer. Parents. Que nous n'avions plus de parents. They wanted us to listen to the recording. Ils voulaient que nous écoutions l'enregistrement. We, our rights, uh, were deprived of afterwards. Par la suite, nous avons été privés de We were used on a daily basis to do the field. Au quotidien, nous avons dû travailler dans les champs à On Proyant. And this meeting where this recording was played. Question. Uh, How long was this after Cette réunion uh, the time où l'enregistrement a été joué, combien de temps était-ce après weeks l'arrestation, after, la disparition de Oum, des jours, des semaines, des mois plus tard after Oum's arrest that this meeting took place? Réponse. It was not long. Four or five days after uh, the arrest of people from time to time, we were youth 
at the time, and uh, we did not know much, and uh, we were told that uh, those people who had been uh, arrested uh, were sent for re-education. In fact, uh, we were not uh, told that uh, they were all arrested. Uh, they said on that uh, those people had gone uh, for education. Half a month already, we uh, did not see anyone returned. Then Après I was semaines, called, some combatants uh, were also called for education at Phnom Penh. I had to go. I was so scared after getting that I was called to Phnom Penh, but I had to go. Combatants remained working and there were no cadres at the time. And you've said that after after the meeting at which this recording was played, réunion, uh, you were joué, uh, assigned to farm rice uh, initially at Capsrao and after that Cap at, at Bung, ensuite, uh, Prayap. À Bung Prayap. Um, how long after the meeting was it that you were sent out Combien to Capsrao or Bung Prayap? I was Réponse. farming the rice for quite long, for three or four months. Pas mal de temps, trois ou quatre mois. Then I was told that I had to go to Ensuite, live at Phnom Penh. Vivre à Phnom Penh. Only I was called to Phnom Penh. I did not uh, Penh. have any idea of uh, their plan. J'ignorais tout de leur projet. I was given a cap and uh, a pair of uh, clothes, and there was no backpack given to me. I thought that I would have been uh, taken away and killed. When I arrived, I was put in a new divisional head office. I was there for three days. Then I was called uh, and assigned to be in charge of uh, radio communication system. system. And after 10 days, I was sent to uh, fight against the Vietnamese. Uh, so, uh, thank you. you. What you've just described Question. is what happened after Vous avez you left qui Boeing passé. Cryop. Après correct? votre départ de Bank Rayap, est-ce exact? Yes. Réponse After I had oui. left Bank Rayap, I went to the Après divisional Rayab, head office and I was trained how to operate the radio communicate system, and later on I was sent to fight against the Vietnamese, I was not given any weapons. On pas remis I was asked to board a ship, a vessel. De à bord un bateau. I was given a, a two pairs of uh, new clothes, on donné deux one or two pairs of clothes. Vêtements. I had un also a chroma and a cap. Une casquette then I boarded et un the vessel. Je suis monté dans le bateau. I was on the ship uh, for one night, and the uh, day after, I reached Tung Lai, uh, but uh, in Kampong Cham province. And I, I left the ship and cooked je rice. Suis descendu du bateau et fait bouillir du riz. After that, Ensuite, I went to the uh, a river front uh, where I saw the wounded Là, people vu des who were transported from uh, Vietnam, said the witness. At the time, I was Ho Cham, à and I was talking to myself that uh, I was uh, taken at to that location to engage in the war. My colleagues, uh, some of them said that uh, no matter what uh, they were assigned to do, they uh, could do, as long as they had rice to eat. Then all of us were put, in, uh, put on to a truck and we were given weapons. 
On nous a donné des armes. And sent to Chong Krong. On nous a envoyé à Chong Krong. By then, Vietnam, the Vietnamese troops uh, were at Chong Kasu and we Les were Vietnamiens at uh, Chong, Chong Krong, the Et preparatory line. La ligne and we used the 80 millimeters artillery to nous avons fire employé des pièces the bullets. d'artillerie de 80 millimètres. I was not really well educated and I did not know Je how to operate instruit. the radio communication Je system well. Then I was told that uh, the Vietnamese uh, were playing and we were boarding the vehicle and Nous left for véhicules. Trey Soka location. Pour aller à Trey Soka. Then I was removed Ensuite. to I was reassigned to help uh, cultivate the rice uh, with uh, l- local people. Pour aider les I was also trained militarily J'ai également suivi un entraînement militaire for three months. Pendant trois mois. I was then told to Ensuite, uh, get a uh, do set rifle and reinforce other forces. De prendre les armes there were also aller en renfort, uh, soldiers from infantry. How could des I attack and de defeat the Vietnamese since they were healthy and strong and we had only a gruel to eat? Qu'ils étaient forts et en bonne santé. Et we nous, were assigned to attack manger. the Vietnamese and uh, we received a counter-attack. As a result, I had no rice to eat uh, for several months and I had only uh, bones of fish to eat. After half a month, uh, we were delivered with a rice and we cooked rice to eat. I was uh, assigned to be engaged in war from time to time from and from location to location. And after the attack by the Vietnamese, I uh, was fleeing to uh, Vietnam, to Nhat Lương, rather. And then I returned to Krochmar. Pumpo, in fact, I was uh, back to Pumpo. And I, I, again, I was sent for uh, fighting against the Vietnamese. I decided to run into uh, villagers' house, and I confessed. And the day after, I fled uh, to my home village to see my parents. I, since I missed them after I left uh, for work. President, it's now time for the adjournment. The hearing will be resumed tomorrow on uh, Wednesday, 21st, uh, September 2016. From 9 a.m. tomorrow, the chamber will continue hearing uh, the witness sign on to the conclusion and then proceeds to hear two TCW uh, 1036 in relation to internal purchase. Relativement au uh, Security personnel, please bring the two of you, Nunji and Kizun Pond, back to the ECC detention facility and have them return into the courtroom on 21st September 2016 before 9 a.m. Le septembre 2016, avant 9h. L'audience est levée.